When someone new comes into an organization, it's the role of a manager or another employee to teach that person their role to ensure that they can be successful in it. So you need to teach in that space. Kia ora, hi, I'm Craig Johns, high performance leadership expert, CEO and managing partner, Speakers Institute Corporate, and the founder of Gravity of Leadership. On today's episode of the Gravity of Leadership series, we're talking about the coach leadership triad. Now I want you to think about three things, teach, coach, and mentor. Plus we're gonna give you a couple of bonuses at the end. But when we look at a team or an organization, we have different phases of people inside that organization. So I want you to think about this. When someone new comes into an organization, it's the role of a manager or another employee to teach that person their role to ensure that they can be successful in it. So you need to teach in that space. Once you get up to more of a managerial level, the, the, the leaders above them will then be coaching them. So they'll be asking lots of questions to the managers or, or even the kind of more senior employees around how can they solve a problem? How can they do something better? And so it allows that person to come to the realization on their own rather than someone telling them or teaching them what to do. But then we go to another level. Once you go beyond and then kind of that early employee to manager to then be at senior leader executive level, then we're looking at mentoring. And so it's either the role of a CEO or a, or a C-suite or maybe even a board or even someone externally to mentor that person when they start getting up a little bit higher in the ranks. And it's around here, come with me and I will show you the way. That's what mentoring is about. So teaching is sharing. Coaching is asking questions so you can come to the realization. And then mentoring is here, come with me and I'll show you the way. So it's a really good, what we call a coach leadership triad. But I want you also to understand that a really good leader will know when to switch between teaching, coaching, mentoring, and also two other aspects. One is facilitating. And that's when you facilitate a group of people to get different ideas, brainstorm to come to a conclusion or to come to a new strategy or focus. And then there's another one, experiential. And that's when you give them the space to be able to learn and understand things on their own. Maybe discover something, try something new. So the coach leadership triad is teach, coach, mentor, but then as a leader, you then want to make sure you can also integrate facilitating conversations and also the experiential where you give people that space to problem solve and learn and grow on their own. Remember, it's important to create a gravitational pull, not a gravitational push as a leader. What is your gravity of leadership today? Ka kite anō. I'll see you next time.